And the International Space Station is about to rise. It's like about to appear. If you guys want to stop and watch it. It's going to be a really bright dot in the sky. I think that's it right there, actually. I think that's it right here. Yeah, Where is it? Like straight in front oh, of us. Yep. Yep. Yeah. That's moving up. Yep. The red one there, it's kind of flashing a little. So, so where that plane is flashing, it's below that and yeah. to the left. The plane is going across it right now. Do you see it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Out to the right. And it's going to get super, super bright. It's going to get brighter than that star up there. It's going up. So, so it's to the right right now. Yeah, right. yeah it's directed to the okay. right, yeah. It's, you Pretty can see it rising. How did it get up there? <laughs> And it'll just become a really bright white light. Okay, it's kind of heading towards us. Right? It's going to be going nearly right above us. Okay, got yeah. it. <laughs> We're here. We're here. Wave. Wave. Moon them. Then we got your telescope. Yeah. Your telescope can track that and make it look closer, apparently closer. Yeah, with the right equipment. Or is it goes too fast? Uh, with the right equipment, you can, for sure. I, I, I'm pretty sure. Just, it's I've only ever seen people like put it against the moon or something and it zips by. I've never seen okay. like a track track of it. It looks like it's got like a little bit of a red light. A plane just yeah. went past it. It's taking a lift, Jerry. It's kind of. <laughs> It's heading straight for Orion. If you find Orion's it's belt, it's straight it's down from Orion's belt. straight for Orion's belt. Wow. If you see Orion's belt, it's headed straight for... It's heading the... straight up toward it. Is it traveling, it's traveling north? Uh, it, it's straight traveling north. east. East. Yeah, northeast. Yeah. Northeast? Do you see Orion's belt? Okay. So binoculars it's really bright a bit, light in the sky uh, that's moving. A little bit better. Yep. Headed yeah, towards uh, Orion. It'll make it a little bit brighter because it's actually an object that we can see. Right. Like you can see it, it would see enlarge it. it. Yeah. Are you there? Did you mute me? <laughs> Did you mute me? I think you muted me. Look how bright that's really moving now. How fast does this travel? Seventeen thousand five hundred miles an hour. Holy yeah. cow! No problem. You can hop off. It. It's going right through Orion, that's really cool. There's Sirius off to the left. It's right in line. Oh, that's so cool. Straight up now. <laughs> and now it's going to be passing through Gemini. So those two stars it's about to go by are uh, Castor and Pollux and Gemini. Uh, it goes over a couple times a day. Okay. Yeah, around the entire Earth it's 16 times per day. But uh, we can only see it at sunset or sunrise, like right after or right before. Sixteen orbits a day, huh? <laughs> okay, and how far is it up? You know that? Two hundred fifty miles. Okay. Yeah, so about just under twice the width of Florida. Mm -hmm. Two hundred fifty miles up, traveling at seventeen thousand five hundred miles per hour. Yep. Which is really cool because. So did you calculate how long it takes to get around the Earth? <laughs> <laughs> it's 93 minutes. Oh, okay. <laughs> really? Wow. There's two brothers, twin brothers. Yeah. And they did a whole test on them, how it affected their bone structure and everything. 
Yeah, Scott Kelly and Mark Kelly. Yeah, Scott yeah, Scott was up there, Mark right? was down here. Yeah, they did the difference and how it affected the bone structure and everything. It's like behind the trees now. Yeah. If you walk on that side, I think it would still be visible. If you guys turn around, the International Space Station's right behind you. The really bright white light in the sky. <laughs> the really bright white dot. Get started over here. It's like fading out now. Yeah, fading, yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Thank you. Well, thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. Of course, for sure. Very uh